this video, I'll demonstrate my process for preparing, performing, and observing the extended column test. Next, we'll do an extended column test. Once again, I've cleaned up this side of the column so it's nice and straight. Extended column test is 30 deep, 30 centimeters deep by 90 centimeters across. So again, I can just measure that out with my saw. Now in the upper corner, I'm gonna place my probe. Now I can wrap my cord. Leave the cord there and lastly I'll cut a pie wedge. Same as compression test, 10 from the wrist, 10 from the elbow, 10 from the shoulder, and looking for any cracks to start or start to propagate or propagate across the entire column. Twenty. Take my glove off to pad my hand a little bit. So you can see it started to crack at 26, made a mental note of it, gave another whack and it just broke apart. So uh, last thing I wanna do, is I'm gonna peel the block off and make sure that we got, uh, we cut as deep as we needed, especially with a targeted weak layer. In this instance, our targeted weak layer was about 25 centimeters down, somewhere in this area and we got no results. Thank you.